Welcome back. See, he's a little punk brat again. Your little bird friend. And then whenever <laughs> he puts on the boots, he's like, yeah. She trots without the boots. When she has the boots, she struts. Yeah, because then she knows she's a sexy bitch. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oh, hey, I bought food. I bought okay. Food that you guys <laughs> bought. I bought um, turkey breast, hoagie rolls, and cheese. Oh. Oh, nice. To make sammies. Sammies. Sammies? Sammies. So, Kelly, guess what your job is. <laughs> I've already got the knife and the mayonnaise already laid out. It's, it's okay. <laughs> I worked at Subway for two and a half years. I paid my dues. That, that's, that's kind of my joke. You know how to do it. It's okay. You'll do I it. do make a mean sandwich. She does, though. I will, yes. I, will, I make a mean sandwich. Did we ever tell you, Dan, that uh, I had her... I, I was training her to make me sandwiches way ah, before I even you. knew her. Yeah, I knew that, yeah. Yeah. Like, you were working at Subway before you and John officially met. Yeah, like, I worked at Subway and his dad would come see me all the time. Yeah. And I would make him, like, nine sandwiches. No, damn it! That, ugh. <laughs> and then me and John started seeing each other years later. I wasn't even working at Subway anymore. Years later, we met up, and we started dating. It's like, you know, meet my, meet my parents. I'm like, okay. So we go meet them, and it's like and over at Danny. Like, oh. And it's like, <laughs> foot-long turkey? <laughs> what the heck? And he's like, Subway, girl? <laughs> it was crazy. You just point down when your mouth falls open. I know you! <laughs> How? How do I know you? I made sandwiches for you. John's just over I'm there. John's just over there rubbing his hands together. Yes, I have an in now. <laughs> I am the best sandwich maker ever. She's professionally trained. I was, man. I did make good sandwiches. Prove it. I taught him, you know, <laughs> if you put chips on a sandwich and it gives it like a crunch factor. So many people did that in high school. I love putting chips on my sandwich. I've ne I never did that until I dated her. Cheetos gives the best crunch. Not the mm -hmm. puff ones, the yeah, cheetos. Like, yeah, the hard Cheetos, yeah. I yeah. understand about making the sandwich crunchy, okay? But I don't, I never understood that. Like, I just did it once. And to me, it doesn't make sense because then you have to take the flavor of the sandwich and match it with the flavor of the chip. Otherwise, it you have oh my God, two different no. flavors. Oh my god, no. a turkey sandwich with some Cheetos, white American cheese, put some mayo on there, a little bit of mustard. We should. <laughs> you should just you should just have like a waterfall effect. Whenever Kelly does that. We should start our own YouTube. We should, we should start her own YouTube, like, <laughs> little videos where it's like Kelly's, sandwiches. Kelly's <laughs> Kitchen of Gourmet Sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> now, today's lesson, we're going to teach you how to make a turkey bologna hoagie with chips. <laughs> <laughs> chips. Tune in next week for a hamburger between two donuts. <laughs> <laughs> you know that's a thing? It yeah. is. <laughs> I, I want to try it. It looks good. You know how many fucking calories are in that, though? Oh, dude. Speaking of calories, um, I saw on Facebook that video a video talking about the heart, the heart Attack Cafe. Yeah the, yeah, the Heart Attack Cafe made that, like, super Heart Attack burgers, like 10 patties and, like, three buns or something. Yeah, and it's, like, 20,000 calories or something ridiculous, like, yeah. not even exaggerating. And if you, win, if you beat the challenge, a nurse... We'll wheel you out in a wheelchair to your car. I need shoes. <laughs> I need shoes. Kelly, quick. Give me shoes. Where are the shoes at before? I, oh, I don't know. I don't know. I just kind of walk and they just kind of appear on my feet. Then I grow three inches. <laughs> Fucking crazy. It's more like three feet with her. She doesn't grow three feet, Dan. She still only has two of them. She doesn't walk around five feet. I was gonna make a penis joke, but she's a girl, fail. and I can't do that. Just, just the biggest fail. What? Just all the fail. Never fail. 
Is that what you're getting at? No, I think I she- I told a really bad, horrible joke earlier that I thought was really I, super funny, and it I really wasn't. I am full of horrible jokes. <laughs> it's all you are, is a book of horrible jokes. <laughs> <laughs> I am just one giant pile of fail. <laughs> Know, you know, from shaking what kids. Said. What was that wand yeah. joke I made in the car? Oh! If it's uh. so horrible, why do you want to repeat it? <laughs>I made this horrible oh, joke that wasn't. Story, Dan. I made this horrible joke story. that wasn't it funny was a, at all. Quick, tell the non-funny story. It was a Mexican joke too. That's what makes it even better. Oh. <laughs> 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 um. Oh, we were talking about. Okay. <laughs> so, we were driving to meet with our pastor, right? And we pass the Mexican restaurant, and there's like four of them outside talking and laughing, having a giggling good time. Oh, no, and I'm just like, I wonder if they're talking about burritos. You know, just making the offhand comment. And then Kelly, um, <laughs> and then Kelly was like, uh, oh, fuck, how'd it go? Oh, you were like, hey, um, oh my god, I'm, I'm, joke's ruined. It was something about... You okay, were like, I, th I think I remember. You made the it was comment. something about Juan and twenty burritos. No, you made the comment. I wonder if they're talking about tacos, and you're talking uh, about how good the tacos were. And then I said um, something like, "Well, I, I only had Juan." And, and then uh, <laughs> oh, I was like, yeah. "Dude, no, you had like six. And then the guy's like, "No, Juan was mainly cooked that day." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. There it is. Oh man. <laughs> Uh, I feel so bad. Usually I can retell those pretty good, but I just, I was drawing a blank. We need to make a new series. Um, fuck, I forgot the name. Racial Stereotypes of the United States no, of America? No, Kelly's Horrible Jokes. Kelly's Horrible, horrible Jokes. <laughs> I do have horrible jokes. We'll slot it in right after her uh, her web series of her uh, sandwich making. Yeah. <laughs> that could be a side Sa channel. Sandwich making at six, bad jokes at seven, <laughs> couch co-op at eight. There we go! Yeah. <laughs> TV fall lineup. Yeah. Then we'll go on to like a seven month hiatus like The Walking Dead does uh, in between yeah. seasons. We're on vacation. Yeah. Well, we'll have somewhat of a good excuse. We're getting Murray. So. Yes. Although, thankfully, by that time, we'll have quite a bit of episodes backlog that we can to schedule in. Yeah. So we technically will be taking a break, but the episodes will still be coming out. Yeah. Which is nice. Because if I had if I had to rely if I if I couldn't schedule episodes to be released on a specific time slot, we would have no internet ever because our internet's only 10 megs, and it takes like 12 hours to upload a 30 minute video. Bird can't walk. Apparently, I can't fly either. How'd you how'd you do that? How to do what? Break apart that puzzle piece. He I failed. The game did. He died. Yeah. Oh my All god. Alright, fuck this game. Taking a break. Next game time on over, couch bitch. Next, Fucking next, game over. Next time on couch co-op. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> yeah, I'll do this level. All right, I'll knock her out. Oh yeah. Whatever man, this Dark Souls level difficulty. <laughs> Welcome back to Couch Co-op. I am currently playing at the moment. I might make some food. We're thinking about going to Wendy's before we uh, go to, uh, what you mean, it's Randy's. Mm-hmm. Well, you want to make a sandwich? I mean, I'm not at all hungry right now, but you can make her warm if she if I'm she's not hungry. hungry either. Okay. So. Much appreciated though. All right, now. But John, I will be making you a sandwich. That is very true. Get in the kitchen, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to be the girl momentarily. <laughs> it's always been my dream. Transgender, right here. <laughs> Kelly's face. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is that why you bought a skirt the other day? Uh, no. Shh. 
quiet. Oh yeah, sorry, you bought a <clears throat> a very manly uh, Chicago yeah. Cubs jersey. I bought a kilt, okay. <laughs> oh, that's what you're calling it. Yes. It is a kilt made of s uh, silk. It's a very comfy kilt. <laughs> it's, it's, very common <laughs> it's very common amongst ballerinas. Mm. They want tutus. It was... That's the joke. He's trying to make his skirt seem like a kilt. Pretty little tutu. Pretty little... Yeah, I can't remember. I don't want these fucking boots on. I need them off. Hit square. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> if you hit square, it'll cancel it out before the timer. So do you get to keep the boots? They're just, like, hidden? No, they, uh... They're like a power-up. They, they come and then leave after so long. Have you already gotten this one? I am, yes. Okay. Ah. Go this way first. Ah. <laughs> Sorry, I, I got really big. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now you see my problem. So when do you get the boots? Whenever you jump into them. Yeah, oh. they're just kind of scattered. You just kind of find them. Yeah. Fucking Gee, yeah. when did you turn into a big purple egg? <laughs> this is a new power, but it's unlocked, actually. <laughs> it's a cheat code. <laughs> Turned your character and your hitbox into a pink egg. <laughs> Does this game have cheat codes? Yes. Probably. What do they do? Um, you can get, like... Double eggs. Um, you can get like infinite, like extra lives and shit. Like kind of your basic stuff. Now, doesn't Grim Hilda, whatever her name is, pop out whenever you use too many cheats? Yeah, like if you over cheat the goddamn it. If you over cheat the game. Hey, it's okay. You needed those anyway. It's true. Then yeah, she's like, hey, quit cheating, you bastard. Really. And then uh. And if you don't heed her warning, she'll, like, do something to your game save. Oh, man. Like, she'll corrupt it or something? Yeah, like, she'll either, like, she'll either kill you and then make you restart whatever level you're on, or she'll do something to it. Hmm. It's kind of neat. There's a, one of the Grand Theft Auto games, if you keep cheating in the online thing, it makes you wear a dunce cap. Oh, really? <laughs> really? That's awesome. There's probably um, five. This is the only game that's online. Either that or um, San Andreas. Maybe. But who plays Something San Andreas anymore? Well, no. <laughs> Get pissed off at it. I'm gonna go this way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wee! Wee! Wahoo! 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 <laughs> he just can't go fast enough. God, am I? I just now realized how impatient of a gamer I can be. <laughs> just like fucking move faster. And her turn. I can tell. <laughs> yeah, when he plays um, Zelda. That he uh, makes Link like roll around in ball yeah. form. It's yeah. all you hear for like a half an hour. Because <laughs> 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 he can't stand walking. <laughs> Which is funny. Dude, you're so impatient. Like whenever you play Sonic, I thought Sonic was honestly glitching out because you're just spamming down. He was just ducking and popping up like every, like fucking two times a frame, and I'm like, is Sonic glitching? This game's broken. Then I see you over there just smashing the down button for no fucking reason. He's impatient. <laughs> Good luck with this one. He can't run through this. He's trying to. <laughs> Did it. You're trying to play a platformer, view heavy <laughs> <laughs> Notice how she even looks down at her feet like, holy shit, this is happening? <laughs> I 
You struck my stuff. Can't touch me. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! Ah! You just stood there. It stopped me. It was like an animation sequence that I couldn't back. get out of. Go to the corner. There's a feather. Oh, sweet. Oh, ow. You okay? Yeah, my jaw's been acting up lately. Mm. It was cracking and popping real bad when I was trying to eat at a barbecue place this morning. Oh, was it? Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh! <laughs> it's too cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Where's your bird? He's so pissed off. He's like, hey, 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 oh yeah. <laughs> I think he's just stuck in the backpack. Oh. <laughs> now what's the point of this one? Uh, you're immune to the swamp water. Oh. So you can like get everything without having to die. Um, you also can get into uh the crocodile area to get the jigsaw piece. Hmm. So there was supposed to be something over here. Probably already got it. That doesn't make you go. <laughs> All that does is eliminate the walk cycle. <laughs> I must dance. <laughs> You're like, I'm gonna fuck you up. I'm sorry. If anything, this form is easier to play in. It is. Because you don't gotta worry about much. You just. Don't fuck with me! <laughs> this guy's just so casual about it. It's just like, do, 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 do. And there we are. Ah! Got going through the nose. That's disgusting. Is that why the interior is green? Yeah. Hi, <laughs> 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 oh, Mr. Va! Greatest crack of ah! Play my game to win a prize! Yeah, 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 whatever. Yes, yes, I get it, come on. Eat more red than me. Oh, wait, let's do this. Oh, 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 you're losing. Ah. You're losing. I will never lose! Oh, you fat bastard! That was mine! <laughs> no! Okay, you can have it. I'm sorry, sir. Oh, shit! What? what? I, oh, they got super sneakers! That'd probably make it a lot easier. You can move, you can move a lot faster. Oh, are those Air Jordans? Probably. I feel like I might need the super sneakers for part two. This is like a two-part one. Oh, really? Yeah, because the second one involves yellow tomatoes. Oh, so you have to choose. Eh. Fuck you! He's catching up. Uh, no! Ah! No! I must! I must! Yes! Uh, Fuck it's you! For, it's first of 30 wins. Uh, wh whoever gets the most in like a minute. Uh oh. You only win easy game. Now we play a harder game. Eat reds, avoid yellow. They not ripe. Ready? No! You didn't give me a chance! Ready, go. <laughs> ah, Fuck you! I can't. I don't got, I don't got the power up. Fuck so what you. happens if you get yellow? Do they just not count? I, I think they take a point, and uh, you you go into a hurt animation. Uh. The point of the the point of it is is to kind of follow his path and like get the guy in front of him that he's going after. Oh really? He's so much faster. Wow, he is. Ah, fuck you! You have quite a lead now. Nope! 
Uh, yes! Get in my brother! Yes. There we go. Bah, lucky. Must play last game, only eat what is shown. What? Bullshit, fuck you. Only eat what is shown, what's that mean? It'll show me a color and I gotta eat what's, whatever color is being shown. Oh, that's not fair. Keep an eye on it for me, please. Yeah, it never right. did. Yellow. Yeller. Old yeller. Old oh, yeller. Looks like worms. Red. <laughs> you got that like you were so close. That was like a frame. Yellow. Oh my god, this is so fucking hard. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, no! Yellow. No! Blue, red! Ah, that's stupid! It changed! I almost said blue! Uh, red! <laughs> <laughs> blue, red, pink, cyan! Yellow! Uh, 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 fuck you! trying to avoid you. I swear to god! No! Yes! Yes! Oh, yes! Man. So close. Suck it, red guy! I'll be taking that. Aww, I want one. <laughs> I want a little bitty crocodile. It'll never grow up. It'll be my cuddly. Is that the turtle with the ball? The video you showed me earlier? Dude, that, that video is so cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 if John were a little crocodile. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking camera is really bad. Red one. Oh, Dan be the crabby red one. <laughs> what? Oh, I'll be the cr oh yeah. What are those things? We uh, they're called Jinjos. I guess they're like the residents of this area. Mm -hmm. If you get enough of them, you get like a jigsaw piece. They're dumbasses. We get lost all the time. Yeah. We call them jelly beans because we can never remember the name. Should I just eat a feather? Yep. I'll take it. Hey, Zick, good luck. There are feathers down there. Uh. So an alligator uh. can't wear the boots? Nope. nope. But he can wear them. He can wear them shoes. <laughs> His fucking braces. <laughs> can wear them Air Jordans. Yeah, buddy. I think I'm almost done with the crocodile. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> <laughs> you want your feet hurt here? No, 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 yeah, no, no. no, no. <laughs> so, did you hear that the flat earthers are trying to use the eclipse as proof of their theories? How the? F yeah. <laughs> Explain. The article I read didn't make much sense. Well, yeah, is it done by a flat earther? No, it was done by, um... The... <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> you kinda deserve that one. You weren't even watching. I thought I... Oh, I can eat in the air. <laughs> Sorry, continue your story. Start making random sounds. <laughs> well, apparently the article, I don't, I don't know, there's something about uh, one of the mythical beasts that hold up the earth was the one that walked in front of the sun. What? That's what caused the eclipse, pretty much. Pretty much. What? what? Yeah. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> that makes my brain hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I love how he drifts. <laughs> there we go. Hey, hey, wake up. Exit that wake up. Want. Wake up. God damn it, get on the. There we are. <sighs> Order! 
Bugra. You know what? Such grace. <laughs> you know what? Mumbo is a... Oh, um, god damn it. <laughs> Mumbo is a negative stereotype. You need to take him out. Yeah. <laughs> I feel offended for all the blacks. <laughs> I feel offended for all of the minorities who practice um, Mumbo Jumbo. Mumbo Jumbo. Hey, Kelly. Hmm. What are some of the craziest glitches you've seen in The Sims? In your game? There's a lot. Oh, man. Well, it's only happened to me once. There was one that I saw where this uh, kid, the, the um, generator, like, fucked up. And the kid was, like, all elongated and just... Yeah, ah. that only happened to me one time, but yes. And I've had a couple of... Well, it happens a lot where my sim will, for well, some reason, just glitch into the floor. Really? And they can't move or anything, so they just die there. <laughs> so I just give up and it's like, well, I'll just play as your sibling or something. Just go ahead and just stay there again. Just go ahead and so, die. <laughs> it just melted to the floor, like, this is fine. That's happened multiple times. So the siblings, like, fused waist deep in the floor, is just like, man, I'm hungry. And the siblings just walking around him doing <laughs> shit. I tried, like, the first time it happened, I tried to give my sim food and stuff, but it just, like, acted like the sim wasn't there. Oh, really? It was so weird. Hmm. Yeah, that game is so buggy. It is really buggy. But I'm scared of 4. Why? I feel like 4, the way it looks, I've never played it, but from what I've seen, it looks too realistic for me. Oh, really? Like... Well, I saw that they're releasing a pet expansion. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. Yeah. You can give them baths and shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, like you actually have to like go to work and then you just them disappearing for a while. Oh. It's he who shall not be named. Mm -hmm. No one likes talking to him. <laughs> <laughs> but, um... <laughs> That's why I run The Sims so far. <laughs> <laughs> Super glitchy, I love three. Three and Sims Medieval are like favorites. Sims Medieval is actually pretty fun. Yeah, it gets a little boring after a while because they never come out with any expansions for it, so it's kind of just the same I love how he over and over. And nothing happens. That's true. It had like that one expansion, Pirates and Nobles or Pirates something like nobles, that. Pirates and Nobles, but that was it. Get in my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I fucking hate this part. Did he just poop you out? No. Oh. Oh, I hate this part. We have to we have to punch little turtles. Aww. It's um it's Mario all over Can you again. Can go in as the alligator and bite them? That's easier than punching them in the face, that's right? Good, that's a good question. I wonder if I could do that. Quiet, please. The famous tip tuck choir will now perform my latest work. It's just a jumbled mess. It's short, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> do you remember the pattern, John? Do you need help? I do, actually. It was this guy. <laughs> no. <laughs> no! You fucking idiot. Alright, alright. No. Which one was it again? Uh. I'm really bad. You want me to do this part? Yeah, why don't you do this part? I'm a part? little bit better at patterns. There you go. <coughs> okay, so it goes purple, red, and then green. Gotcha. Yes. No. The blue. Light blue. It's light blue. It's, it's light blue, then the dark purple. Shut up, John. You're bad at patterns. <laughs> <laughs> you just fucking come up and just murder these. You just punch them in the... Just punch them, and you're like, do music better. Okay. Yeah. Red. Raphael. Donatello. Okay. Kelly, didn't you say in The Sims 3 you can actually, like, woo death to, like, make it to where he won't take someone's life? Yeah, like... If you make friends with death in Sims 3, um, and you are, are witnessing someone dying, you can plead on their behalf, and sometimes death will spare their life. Huh. Why would you want to do that? 
Like, I mean, I guess if it was like with a family member, but like just a random schmo, like would you, like just like, eh, he's fine. And like, <laughs> if, if you're friends with Death and you're dying, sometimes he'll spare you. Oh, that's fucking cool. It's like, hey man, can I like have a couple more years? <laughs> All right, but I can't give you another extension. And uh, I was watching PewDiePie play Sims once. And, um, he... Wait, you take damage if you get it wrong? Yeah, goddammit, Dan, you're so bad at patterns. Well, you're supposed to help me out, fucker. There's three of us here. <laughs> you got me on the sim topic. You did this. You started it. You did this. <laughs> what I do? You broke the controller, Dan. Two, three, one, two. Excuse me. Right. What? Orange. Orange. Where's orange? That's yellow. Yellow, orange, same thing. Pretty sure they're two different colors, bud. And then it goes that one down there. This one? Yes. Anyway, then it goes um, orange. I was watching PewDiePie play Sims, and he actually got into no, a relationship that with was wrong. Death. Like, he started dating Death. You, you should get some life. <laughs> You can't get serious with death, but they can be a romantic interest. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. And he tried so hard to get death to make a baby with him, and death just wouldn't. <laughs> Fuck me! Death's just Give like this. me a good dickin'. Death's just like, that's not a good idea. Death, well, all he'll do is kiss you. That's still not a good idea. <laughs> then you can literally say, I just had a kiss of death. <laughs> <laughs> The so, family that I just deleted, um, my daughter was friends with Death. Really? Mm-hmm. Five music notes remaining. We'll come back to this guy to get five more notes. I don't want to collect them all again. Camera. Yep. That was fun times. Okay, well, I'm gonna go make some food. You do that. Oh, but that's the beauty of it. You don't need to keep talking or keep finding things to talk about. We're not. Yeah, like. Constantly find shit to talk about. Like that's not the point. The point is. We play games and we just talk. Mm -hmm. So you play The Sims because you're going to be, as John said, making sim noises. And we'll make fun of you for it and then it will just lead into jokes. That's how we normally do it. We won't make fun of you, don't we? We're not heartless people. What time are we leaving for the uh, We got to be there at 6. What time is it? 4.10. Well, probably... I said no since you uh, wanted to go since... pay the water bill and pick up those parts first and get food. We'll probably head out shortly after we finish this level. Okay. This level shouldn't be too much further. Yeah, no, we, we, like, it would be obnoxious if, if we had talking, like, the whole time. Mm-hmm. Because then it leads into fake, into fake conversations. We don't want that. Remember, we care about the people, but not really. Kind of. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it depends. Okay, I got all of the notes. Now I just need to get the last two jigsaw pieces. Ah, ah, oh. That sounded like it hurt. <laughs> that was awful. <laughs> oh my gosh. What? Hot Topic is selling Slytherin makeup brushes. Slytherin makeup brushes? Yes, do you see these? 
I do. How Aren't are they, they cool looking? How are they slithering? The snakes. The serpent. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm a Hufflepuff, but dang, they're cool. I'm a Ravenclaw. Yeah, I know you are. <laughs> like, You're like, yeah, 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 I don't really give a shit. <laughs> this is me. <laughs> That's cool, though. We should get some sometime. It's funny, because when I took the quiz as a kid, I was Gryffindor. But now that I'm an adult, I took it, and I'm a Hufflepuff. So it's funny how things change from your mindset when you were a kid to an adult. It is. You know, like, with life experiences. And... Yeah. All that fun shit. That's gonna prove how, like, some maybe the sorting hat can make mistakes because, like, like wasn't Gilderoy, Gilderoy Lockhart a Ravenclaw or something? And he turned out being just pathetic and stupid. I don't. I think so. Yeah. And Snake turned to be like super heroic and stuff, and he was a Slytherin. He was a Slytherin. <laughs> Same thing with. Uh... Granted, though, it took Snape to have to kill Dumbledore in order for him to become heroic. Yeah, but it was a part of the whole plan. Like it was. Yeah. Did you see that theory? About how um, there were actually two saviors and it wasn't just Harry Potter. Neville was also the chosen one. I heard that theory too. What now? There's a theory out there where Neville Longbottom, I mean, that's his name, Yeah. where he was actually the chosen one and not Harry. What? Uh-huh. And it makes a lot of sense. Um, oh. <clears throat> because he, like, I don't exactly remember, like, the video, the whole video itself, but... The dude had a lot of good points, like something about how he too was an orphan, and like, him and Harry had a lot of similarities. Um, they were both Gryffindor. Um, I'll have to show you the video sometime. It was done by, it was, it was done by the Game Theorists. Oh yeah. Speaking of videos like that, um, I didn't read this, but for a while there was, um, a fan theory going on about how Jar Jar Binks was like the Sith Lord, like the main Sith Lord antagonist person. You hear that? I heard about that one, but that one's kind of dumb. I mean, like he was the one that did give the Emperor Palpatine like, mm, like full power over the Senate because he was the final deciding vote. But he had no fucking clue. Jar Jar Binks was an idiot. No, 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 not Jar Jar Binks bringing down. In it, Jar Jar Binks being a Sith Master. What? Yeah. That makes no sense. How? Well, I didn't, again, I didn't read this. This is just from what I was told. But, like, um, during the fight with, um, during the fight with, like, um, the. This is hard. She's fucking hard as hell. Give us this one. Oh, fuck. Fuck. One of these two. I think it was this one. Nope. Red. Purple, blue, light purple, red, light purple, yellow. That pattern's a lot easier. Yeah, it is. Boop. 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 I claim this turtle in the name of Bandro and Kazooie. I am taking this one with me. Fuck you. Alright, well this level's done. I'm 
sharing this recipe for uh, five for five cheese mac and cheese. Make me make it sometime. All right, I'll make you make food. Before we leave the level, there's one more thing we have to do. How to become crocodile again and leave the level and there's a button we gotta press. But then yeah, this level basically done at that point. <sighs> Too slow, gotta go. Did you get all that from the Yeah, it's like 12 bucks. Which is about when I would have spent it Subway. Yeah. And you got more food. Yeah, I did. Uber <laughs> <Yeah>. Uber <laughs> What'd you think I said? I didn't I didn't know what you said at first. Watch me strut my stuff. Strut, strut, strut my stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Short work of this level, holy shit. did put a few pounds back on. I was right. But what I started doing was I still eat what I want to eat on weekends, but then I diet on weekdays, which is easier because I'm at work anyway and don't think about food. And I, so I did that all last week, and I lost that couple of pounds that I put on. Oh, wow. So I think I'm going to start sticking with that, just not really worrying about the diet on weekends, but then on weekdays, worry about it. Because it's not even really worrying about it anyway, because I, I'm at work, I'm so focused on the kids and everything, I'm not thinking about food. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's way easier for me to stick to my diet on my work days. Because I can't even think about getting a drink when I'm at work. It'll be my lunch break and be like, oh damn, I haven't had anything to drink all morning. I'm thirsty as fuck. I'm thirsty as hell. <laughs> What? You're just like, why am I so thirsty? I've been drinking the children's tears all morning. <laughs> <laughs> That's your next level, by the way. Good luck. I hate ice levels. All you. Freeze easy peak. Say that five times fast. Yeah. What's up here? Mmm, this ice. <laughs> <laughs> well, alright. I think on that account, we'll see you guys next time on Couch Co-op. See you guys next time. Later! Did your phone just stay on? It should.